what we do here is go back, 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 back. back. Hey guys, and welcome back. Well, it's with heartfelt sympathy. Uh, love and Hip Hop Hollywood just lost another star. Now, the next season of Love and Hip Hop Hollywood is reportedly getting a major makeover as one of its newest additions is said to be exiting the stage left. Now, according to the jasminebrand.com, newcomer Keisha Cole will reportedly not be returning for the popular reality series next season. Now, uh, the R&B star has openly revealed that she only joined the cast to promote her new album and expand her fan base. Now that she's covered all bases, it seems as her intended mission is now complete. Now, there remains, however, some conflicting reports as to why she is leaving. Now, neither Cole nor the show's creator, Mona Scott Young, have revealed or released an official statement as to why she reportedly won't be returning. Hmm. Well, all right. I wonder if it's one of those resignations like uh, Omarosa got. Or firing, or I mean, resigning, or. And speaking of which, Amarosa. And speaking of Amarosa. Now, the former assistant to President Donald Trump, Amarosa Newman, made quite the debate on Celebrity Big Brother, warning her co stars, along with everyone else in America, that the country is in danger. Now, uh, in a clip from episode of the CBS reality show that aired Thursday, Amarosa co-star and reality TV star Ross Matthews asks her, should we be worried? And Newman nods, yes, with tears in her eyes, saying, it's not going to be okay. It's not. Now, she also claimed on Thursday episode, she would never vote for Trump again. <laughs> Telling Matthews, God, no, never, in a million years, never. Now, Amarosa, who says she resigned in December as Director of Communications for the Office of Public Liaison, uh, but the White House said that she was fired and carried. Oh, okay. But she claims she was haunted by the President's tweets. I was haunted by tweets every single day. Like, what is he going to text next? Now, on the TV program, she claimed she urged the president to tone it down a notch on social media. But what? But that White House staffers would come to his rescue. They would say, keep her away from him, Newman said. Don't give her assets. Don't let her talk to him. The White House said it didn't take her comments very seriously. Now, Amarosa was fired three times on The Apprentice, and this was the fourth time we let her go. White House Principal <laughs> Deputy Press Secretary Rod Shaw told reporters Thursday, now, uh, Amarosa first became famous in 2004, starring with Trump on NBC's The Apprentice. Trump invited her back for round two, this time in Celebrity Apprentice. In 2008, only to have Trump <laughs> fire her again. Now, Amarosa has not responded since the White House comment, but did showcase a big smile and a tweet pic thanking Celebrity Big Brother fans for tuning in to the season premiere. <laughs> well, uh, my take on that. Now, we told Amarosa um, Black Ass that Trump was not interested in black folks. Now, didn't we? 
But oh, she was Trump this. Oh, she was kissing the ass and everything. And now she got a, a fired. But now she talks about Trump and talks about what well, we already knew that. <laughs> I tell you, but one thing I tell you about Miss Amarosa. Hey, she's a hustler. She gonna make that money. Already got another job. <laughs> I tell you that Amarosa is something else, and she needs to stop telling what she's gonna do. I'm gonna write a tell-all book. I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna do that. She she don't need to tell, do it instead of talking about it. Do it because we don't want to see her in the uh, a lake or something or a bathtub or, or whatever. So she need to do what she going to do. Don't talk about it. Do it. All right, guys. Thank you so much for watching my video. I hope you will like, share, and subscribe to my channel. And as always in party, be blessed. What we do here is go back, 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 back.